If you're here to research a new RV, I've got a great real life review for you. Two trips, two floor plans on the Thor Omni 4x4 Super C diesel motorhome. Hi, my name is Vicki and I work at Demartini RV Sales. We are the number one selling dealer for the Thor Omni in the country. And one more thing that makes us special is our exclusive wilderness package that you can only get here. We are RV solar experts and have crafted this system to be the most compatible, highly functioning solar battery system for this RV. Here's a look at the RVs. First trip, we took a 2022 Thor Omni SB34 to the Oregon Dunes. We were towing a 16 foot trailer carrying a Razor side by side. It's about a nine hour drive to our campground north of Coos Bay, Oregon. The stay consisted of five nights of dry camping with no hookups. So this trip is a great opportunity to test out the solar. The second trip is in a 2022 Thor Omni RS36. This chassis and floor plan is new for 2022. Built on the F600, this beefed up chassis has bigger tires, wheels, stronger axles, and increased cargo carrying capacity, as well as a 12,000 pound tow limit. The length is 37 feet long, and we took it on the scenic Pacific Coast Highway. Our destination is Gualala River Redwood Park, a beautiful campground on the California coast, but it requires some of the most difficult driving for about 50 miles with oceanside cliffs and hairpin turns. We took the whole family and camped with hookups for four days. Now let's start with something that both of these coaches have in common, the Wilderness Package. We equipped each coach with 830 watts of advanced circuitry solar panels, added two high efficiency AGM Lifeline batteries, and an upgraded solar controller. Now let's talk about our trip to Coos Bay, Oregon. We will be meeting family and friends for a fun five days of cool weather, working the dunes, and celebrating Independence Day. Between all of us, we had a whole collection of styles of RVs. Another Thor Omni, a diesel pusher, and a Class C gas RV. We all towed trailers. Here are some highlights we noticed using the Thor Omni SV34 on this trip. One of them was tow mode. This was our first experience towing a trailer. As far as weight, we could hardly tell it was back there. We just needed to be aware of the extra length while navigating parking lots and fuel stations and the extra weight while braking. Thankfully, the Thor Omni makes towing easy with the exhaust brake combined with tow mode on the transmission. The Thor Omni is capable of towing 10,000 pounds on the F550 chassis and 12,000 pounds with the F600 chassis. Let's see an ocean out there. We camped for five days with no hookups. The sky conditions were mostly overcast and cloudy, but we were still able to get enough charge from the sun to keep our batteries charged the whole trip while only using the generator when we needed it for cooking meals or using the toaster or things of that nature. Our campsite didn't have any trees obstructing the sun and that seemed to help a lot as well. The SB34 floor plan has two electric refrigerators. One of them is in the outside kitchen and we were able to keep them cold the whole trip with the help of the Wilderness Package solar system. One of my favorite features in the Thor Omni is the overhead bunk. It is the largest in the industry. It's very close to the size of a queen sized bed. We can fit our whole family of five and easily sleep three kids up there. There are a few features that set the SB34 floor plan apart from the other Omni floor plans. First is the kitchen. This floor plan has the largest amount of counter space. You have a large space between the sink and the stove 
along with two extra large drawers. Second is the bathroom. This floor plan has a large roomy bathroom with a lot of cabinet space, towel rack, and a largest shower out of all of the Omni floor plans. And third is the spacious bedroom. It features a king size tilting bed. It's easy and simple to tilt the bed with the press of a button. This gives you more floor space, which is nice to access drawers and for changing. And it also provides a nice backrest while sitting up in bed. I've had quite a few people ask me if I can post a video of us driving so they can hear the road noise in the cabin of the coach. Here's a video of us driving through one of the many fires in California this summer. You can hear the engine, the radio, and our conversation with the kids riding in the back. For the second coach, we're testing out the new 2022 Thor Omni RS36. This is our first time driving the new F600 chassis. Vicky would like me to talk about the driving experience of this new 22 Thor Omni RS36. I think that being on the F600 chassis instead of the F550, bigger tires, wheels, just a beefier chassis helps to smooth out the ride. We're on Interstate 80 right now and it's pretty straight but not totally smooth. But with the smoother ride it's quiet in the cabin and we're going 70 right now and we can easily carry on a conversation without feeling like we have to shout. Goes over the gaps in the road, small potholes, handles really well. So while we're driving in this relatively flat stretch of Interstate 80, you can put it in the eco mode. It's got all these different drive modes. Normal, you can switch from normal to eco. Really get your fuel economy up. See for this trip so far, we're averaging over 15 miles a gallon. Now, any grades you go into or climbing, a place where there's more acceleration, that's gonna drop some. And if you're going up over a pass or something like that, you probably want it in the normal driving mode, which will also burn more fuel. But 15 miles a gallon down here in the California Central Valley, Interstate 80, I-5, that's pretty good for a unit this size. We're headed to the California coast and onto the Pacific Coast Highway 1, where we will travel for about 50 miles of narrow, windy, uneven roads along ocean cliff sides. We wanted to drive this section with the least amount of traffic possible, so we timed the drive to be at night, when most of the sightseers would be off the road. Many of the hairpin turns were so sharp that we had to cross into the other lane in order to make it without scraping the motorhome. We were impressed by the Omni's performance on this difficult drive. Although it was stressful, the coach handled great. On some of the challenging turns, we noticed huge gouges in the road from other vehicles scraping as they tried to go through. We are happy to report that the Omni's ground clearance, along with careful driving, helped us make it to our destination in one piece with no scrapes or scratches.
The RV lifestyle is all about waking up and walking straight out your front door immersed in nature. We had a fun four days enjoying campfires, ocean waves, sandy beaches, kite flying, fishing, and enchanted forests with friends. The RS36 floor plan is a dream. More storage than we could fill, just saying a lot. Along with the luxury ride, drive, and features. Plenty of sleeping space for up to 10 people. Here's a walkthrough of the floor plan. We got to take this coach on one more trip where we gained one new co-pilot. Even with a family of five plus a puppy, we still had plenty of room for all of our things and to move freely about the space. Here's a pretty cute example of the increased hallway space in the RS36 floor plan. I hope you enjoyed watching this real life review of the Thor Omni. Please comment with any questions you have for me and I'd love to help you. If this looks like the RV for you, give us a call at Demartini RV Sales, 1-800-576-1921 or send me an email at vicky at demartini.com. Thanks for watching.